Hey folks, welcome back to Puzzle Agent 2. We have returned to the town of Scoggins, Minnesota. Um, we have, uh, through rather shady circumstances, been led to a, uh, a room at Valda's Inn, and I am currently picking gum. We turn, can I turn the lights on? No, I guess not. Oh, it's, it's late. late. There's plenty of time to investigate It's a light morning. switch, Nelson. Is that gum? Hmm. For a second, I thought I saw someone on the street below. Probably nah. just my imagination. Okay. No, it probably wasn't. Ah, uh, a hidden people lamp. Just stare at yeah. me all night while I sleep. Yeah. Comforting. Yeah. Yeah, the hidden people are the uh, the little gnomes. Um, at the end of the first game, they grabbed the eraser factory foreman and ran off with him to parts unknown, uh, possibly to space. I, I have no idea what the hell is going on with these things. I'm, I'm actually slathering some lotion on my hands right now because I feel like my skin is about to peel off. It's like two degrees out here. Anyway, help trace a sighting of the hidden people by arranging these photos in order. All right. Okay, well, there's the first set of footprints. This is like that puzzle that Sheriff Bog did to me last time where he rearranged all the photos. Okay, there's hidden people footprints, two more people footprints. There's Nelson, I guess. And then there's snowmobile tracks and more gnomes. So that ought to do it. And yes, uh, Nelson's friend at the uh, Department of Vegetable Research now, Vegetable Crimes, is submitting my puzzles for me. That's why there are vegetables all over the envelope now. And also we have achievements, as you might have noticed, uh, which is why the cost of solving the puzzles has gone up, because, you know, achievements cost more. Uh, that wasn't, that so, wasn't bad. so bad. No. Okay. Um, why don't we just go to bed? It's clear now that the like mysteries jammies, of Scoggins Nelson. go deeper than the incident at the Eraser Factory. And I'm convinced I made the right choice to come back. Yeah. Assuming, of course, I make it through the night. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, people are not real happy to see Nelson. Um. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, snap. It's the spaceman from the beginning of the first game. Uh? What? <laughs> Settle down, Nelson. There it is. Okay. Nah. Yeah. And what did the space mailing? Isaac Dabner does not exist. Huh? Um. I. Um. Oh, so we uh, are missing a few people in Scoggins. Let's see. Okay. What? It's no good. Oh, Someone knows I'm in town because I've just received a note. Isaac Davner does not exist. I won't have any idea what that means until I've gotten enough information to ah. solve the puzzle on the other side. He's missing My information. First priority That's the problem. Tomorrow is to take this note into town and find out what these names have in common. Uh huh. Good morning, Nelson. Oh, someone stuck gum on the window again. Hello. Hi. He seems friendly enough. Oh, there's an, uh, another missing person, possibly? Okay, this is not the Louvre. It's a poster. Just stick it up there. Give me that gum. Give me that gum. Give me that gum. Uh, hey, buddy. Stupid flyers. Uh, crash of a black moon. Um. Um. Excuse me. Daryl. Oh, it? that's Daryl. That's right. I. Hey, you're that FBI guy. Hi, Daryl. Special Agent Tevitz, Puzzle Research Division. Yeah, well, I've got a missing person case for you guys to solve. Oh, really? A uh, factory foreman? That's old news. I'm talking about my brother, Daryl. Yeah, Daryl and his brother, Daryl. Yeah. Could you tell me more about your brother's disappearance? 
We were out past Sassamy Woods a couple of days ago. Oh, God. Daryl split off on his own because he said we were in Barrel Oak country. But what? Barrel oh, they're real. Don't doubt it. Um, and what the happy hell is a Barrel Oak? Scared? Nah, he went hunting for it. Oh, shit. I haven't seen him since. <sighs> Great job, Daryl. Have you seen or heard from Isaac Davner since I left? Who? The foreman of the eraser factory. Uh, huh. He went missing after the factory so shut he's, down. So he's been oh, yeah, disappeared? Him. Yeah, figures. People here go missing all the time. And y'all didn't see fit to tell me this the first time through. Do you know Why? anything about the hidden people? Great. My brother goes missing and the FBI comes to ask me about forest gnomes. You I don't, don't call them gnomes. They, they don't like that. When I was four years old and listened to bedtime stories. Okay. All right, bro. Settle down. All right. Let's 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 solve your puzzle. Let's... Where have you been putting up those flyers? I've been getting permission first. It's legal. Yeah, well, I'm Need not really worried about that. Sure. Federal tax dollars should work. There you go. Daryl is passing out flyers in the neighborhood, but the flyer bandit is at large and will steal them, you know, as one does. Figure out where to place the stacks to ensure 50 flyers reach the end of the paths. Ensure that exactly 50 flyers will make it to the other side of town. Each person will pick up one paper at a fork in the road. Half will take the left, half will... A uh, bandit will steal the flyers from anyone who passes by him. Okay, so we've done a puzzle like this before, except with fish. So, um... The short stack needs to take the safest route. Which would be this one. So one flyer will definitely get here. One might get here. Um, no, actually, it needs to go there. Um, what's the rules again? Exactly 50. Okay. So that's a possible flyer bandit. We're going to put that one there, because uh, either one of those could... Okay, it's 20. Nope, still ain't right. Okay, I I'm chewing some nasty gum. Let's find a way to distribute the same number of flyers in locations where the bandit may strike. Okay. 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 Um. Huh, give me another hint. Ensure that twelve flyers are distributed to each of the bands. Okay. Okay. So that one. Boom. Boom. Now, how the hell do you get 12 flyers there? Oops. I mean, it can't be, because that's... Wait a minute. They'll go to the left fork. How do you get 12 friggin' flyers over there? No, definitely not. Okay. Um. Um. Well, now I'm completely screwed here. Let's just start over. Ah! Okay, so 12 flyers to each one. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna. I give up. Twenty-two. To, okay. Twenty-two. Two. And eight. Ah. Ah. Okay. That's got to be it. Oh, God. Non toxic. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah. D plus passable. Yeah. Okay. There you go. 
That should get everybody in town on the lookout for Daryl. There we go. I doubt it no. in this town. Daryl's going to get... All the yeah. Time in Nobody even notices anymore. Oh, God. There have been other missing people? Plenty others. Even that researcher over at the campground... No, seriously, this would have been week. good information to have in the first game. Do you know where I could... He's got a trailer at the Wallows campground. Name's Alfred... Uh, something, something or other. other. Have fun, Mr. FBI. Try looking for my brother while okay, you're at Okay, Daryl. Just chill, bro. It sounds like Isaac Davner's just one of many missing people around Scott. Yeah. The cases might all be related. I'm heading to the Wallows to ask a researcher there about his missing friend. Okay. Uh, and look for Daryl's brother. <laughs> there you go. Nice save, Nelson. Okay, on the snowmobile. Where is the there's the campgrounds? Wow, that's um that's awesome. Okay. Let's see, uh gum? There oh there's lots of gum. There's gum. Gum there's a gum. Um, nobody. I, oh my goodness! My cat's trying to get up where he should not be. What have we here? A campfire. That fire pit hasn't been used since the last thaw. Assuming this place ever thaws. Oh god. Which it very likely doesn't. Being as how it's up in uh, BFE, me, Minnesota. Sir. I'm looking for a researcher. You found one. Yay! I'm Special Good. Agent Tethers with the FBI Puzzle Research okay, Division. Okay, Nelson. Doctor, it's obvious Rishak. they don't want you here. But that's my father's name. Call me Alfred. I'm doing Maybe you shouldn't be in introducing yourself as. Yeah. Okay. Someone Never in mind. town said your friend had gone missing. Friend? Oh yes, they must be talking about my graduate student, Will Medlock. Will Medlock. Great, great young man. What a name. Disappeared. Oh, when was that? Two months ago. That was before the incident at the eraser factory. But no one mentioned it before. Retcon. I'd say I'm surprised. Local law enforcement was no help. Yeah, well, that's... Yes, I've met the local Yeah, Sheriff Bog is kind of a... more interested in puzzles than missing people. Kind of a weirder, gentler version of George from Deadly Premonition, which, by the way, I still want that crossover. What is an anthropologist doing What is doing my cat chewing on? Minnesota? Son, give me that. Same thing uh, nope, too late. He ate it. Else. I'm studying people. <laughs> the people of Scoggins? <laughs> is there enough to study? Uh, well, what there is oh is pretty yes. interesting. The shared reality made by the people and their folklore. I've been uh, here for years, and I've just barely scratched the surface. Don't you get the sense that this is a town on the cusp of something big? Um, their folklore, their fascination with puzzles. I it's as if yeah. the energy of thought is being transformed into solving one of the great problems of our age. Okay. Moving right along. Do you know anything about the missing factory foreman, Isaac Davner? Who? Ah, yes. Fascinating story, that. A real suburban Oh, he actually, uh, actually the remembers. people of Scoggins, he's the archetype of the martyr. The ritual sacrifice made as an attempt to um, serve control over capricious nature. Wait a second. Nelson's Davner's not having not any of your shit he's here. He's a real person. I've met him. Myths are real, Agent Tethers. We're all characters playing roles. The hero on a quest for truth. Um, the wise, mysterious sage who serves as his guide. Wise. Um, right. Yeah. So. You must know something about the local stories about gnomes. gnomes. The hidden people? Well, of course. They're the ones who brought me here in the first place. Uh, I'm studying oh, the myth. Not, and not literally. Of the okay. <laughs> thought they actually picked oh, him up and carried him up here. Cult, the Brotherhood of Scoggins. Oh my, yes. Frightfully mad, all of them. Yeah. Be careful, Agent Yeah, Tethers. uh, Bjorn. Our friend Bjorn is one of them. Makes them extremely driven and extremely dangerous. Yeah, we've noticed that. Thank you. Oh, th was, is there more? Is there anything else you can tell me about this missing grad student, Will? Well, now that I think about it. I wonder if spending time in Scoggins was starting to have an effect on him. Yeah, it, it does How that. How do you mean? He became unfocused. Talked <clears throat> about nightmares and whispers. 
I didn't think much of it at the time. Yeah. You walked away in the middle of one of my discussions about the transformative power of myth and legend. I thought he was just bored, but I never saw him again. <gasps> Ooh, excuse me. That's been a long day. Excuse me. How long have you been here in Scoggins? Well, let's see. About 15 years? What? I'm on my eighth government grant. Oh, my God. Okay. I'm outie. Thanks for your time, Alfred. Yeah. If you hear any more about Isaac Dabner or your missing friend, please let me know. Yeah. And turns right around. I've just spoken with a mild-mannered but extremely driven agent from the FBI. Oh my He's God! For information about the my soulmate. And a rash of disappearances in the area, including young Wills. Of course, if he's investigating Nelson, a missing you found case, your pale mate. Best talk to Sheriff Bog. The sheriff may not be helpful, but he is the one man in town with information about all the missing residents. Oh God! I gotta go talk to that asshole. What he said. <laughs> Oh, Nelson, you found a buddy. Isn't that cute? Um, real quick. I'm gonna do a thing here. Uh, I'm gonna adjust some, uh... There we go. Okay. Okay. That's better. Any Anything else to poke? Okay. I guess we've got to go talk to Sheriff Bog. Oh, God. Lights are off. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Yeah, last we saw Sheriff Bug, he was tripping balls um, over a crossword puzzle that um, Nelson threw to him like a bone to a dog. Bog? Dog? Eh, eh. Um, so Sheriff Bog may have gone bye-bye. I'm desperate enough to visit Sheriff Bog's office, but he's already working against me. A note on the door says, out to grab a bite. Oh. If I want any answers, I'll have to head to the Moose Ear Diner. Oh, goody. Uh, is there any visible gum here? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright. So that's, uh... Got to the middle of nowhere, to the Moose Ear Diner. There's another Daryl flyer up there. There's gum. Mmm, loot fisk. Uh, I think that's all the gum there is to gum. Okay. Hi, Sheriff. How you doing? First of all, let me get this uh, butt gum here. There's that guy who um, is a black market. Oh, shit. And he is, um, yeah. Hi, Steve. Steve is, uh, in the black market gnome tethers. business. Grapples tethers. <laughs> okay. Have you seen Isaac Davner around town? Davner? The old eraser factory. Yeah, family. yeah. Oh, nobody's seen him since the incident. There seem to be a lot of missing persons cases yeah. around Scotland. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff happens. Did you know any of the A lot people? of stuff is happening, apparently. Like Just here for business. Business, yeah. What can you tell me about the hidden people? I'm not into that anymore. <laughs> the market dropped out on no Oh, things. really? Oh, no, sorry to hear I mean that, Steve. Real, ones. real hidden people? Are you trying to catch me saying something crazy? Is this entrapment? No, 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 Steve. I'm just... Are you okay, Steve? You seem tense. I'm not tense. Lots of people have trouble sleeping. It doesn't mean anything. How long have you had trouble sleeping? Uh -huh. Since the eraser factory reopened. Why? Just uh -huh. asking. Uh-huh. Gnomes are all messing with people. How's business? I'm not into tchotchke smuggling anymore, if that's what you're asking. Okay. No, I, I was just... You can't prove anything. No, I, I'm... Calm Steve. Down. Okay. It's that I just Unknot can't your doors here, okay? Yeah, know. let me... Let me see your problem. Transport the four animals across the river in as many trips as you need. Keep in mind the boat's weight limit and prevent the critters from eating each other. While the animals are friendly, left unattended, the bear will eat the wolf. The wolf will eat the mongoose. The mongoose will eat the snake. The snake will eat the bear somehow. <laughs> Okay.
okay. The, um, yeah, that, that must be, oh god. You know, I don't even know. Okay. So, maximum 201. So we can't leave the bait the, the, the bake, <laughs> the bear and the snake together. Um, we can't leave the wolf and the mongoose together. But we can take the wolf. Oh shit. Okay, that doesn't work. Cross the str ah. Okay, um Can we take the snake and the wolf? Okay. Um, if we take the mongoose, shit's gonna get real. No, no, the bear eats the snake. Yeah, yeah, the snakey. <laughs> okay, back on the boat. Oh, I've got an idea. Give me back the snake. Oh god, that's not going to that's not going to work. Okay. Um Give me back the wolf. Let's put the wolf here, put the mongoose here. Put the mongoose there. All right, this ought to do it. There we go. All right, got it. Hey. <laughs> I like I like the uh, the puzzles in this for this uh this one. They're a little bit a uh, little bit you know, more puzzly. <laughs> okay, I'm going to talk to Glory. Uh, this is Mrs. Daphner. The foreman's wife, Glory Dabner, yeah. is still working at the diner, as if nothing's happening. Yeah, uh, Glory is in on this shit. Even though her husband's still missing, and the last time I saw her, she was using a chainsaw to try to drown me under yeah, a lake of ice. Yeah, yeah. I still don't I, know I, how I she's left involved, that out. but I better make it clear I'm only trying to help if I want to get any information. Yeah, she was hanging out at the uh, at the lodge with uh, Bjorn and the uh, Norwegians, too. Yeah, there's, there's uh, crazy Norwegians. So I'm going to talk to Glory here. Mrs. Davner, Glory, I think Isaac must have been involved in something big. And I forgive you for trying I don't to drown have any me. Idea what you're talking about? Okay, all right. Hello, Sheriff Bog. Agent Heathers, what are you doing back in town? We got everything under control. No, we don't need no, the you FBI don't. Poking its. Calm down, Sheriff. I'm just here on personal leave. Hmm. Well, I keep my eye on tourists just the same as FBI agents. Okay. When I filed my report with the Bureau, I left out the part about you holding me at gunpoint. Yeah. Come on, Tethers. I don't know how you boys do things in Washington. But out here, sometimes a man's got to do what he's got to do. Um. Even if it means drawing a gun on a fella. Yeah. What? Yeah, um, Sheriff Bog is a jerk. I hope you've started to take Bjorn's cult seriously. I'm convinced that they're behind the disappearance of I Isaac want that Allen. gum. What? That's crazy. Your the face is crazy. The Scoggins are valued members of this community. Uh-huh. I'm not going to let them be harassed by anybody. FBI or no. Okay, so what about all these... I've heard yeah. that Isaac Dabner is only one of the people to go missing around Scoggins. What can you tell me about the other disappearances? What can I tell you? Nothing. Well. Sure, I got files on all the so-called missing persons. Ah? Uh? 
And I don't have to show them to any FBI man, especially one who's not here on official business. Okay. I believe the hidden people have something to do with the incident at the factory. Agent Tatter, please. Please. Just because we don't live in some fancy city doesn't mean you can treat us like gullible yokels. Well, if the shoe fits, bye, asshole. You're just as helpful as always, Sheriff. <laughs> oh, snap. Glad to be a service agent, Tatter. Enjoy Ooh. your time in our town and behave yourself. Agent Tethers. Ah. We need to talk <gasps> outside. Thank you, Glory. What did you need to talk about, Mrs. Davner? It's about Isaac. Yeah? He's not back yet. He's supposed to be back. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna call her. That attacking an FBI agent with a chainsaw is a federal offense. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that. Okay, Just apology accepted. You were going to stop the Brotherhood. I couldn't let you. Isaac needed to finish his journey. Okay, what the hell is going on here? Why are you worried about Isaac now? You're the one who helped the hidden help them take him. Yeah. You don't understand. It was the only way to save him. From Save him? Isaac was troubled. Yeah, okay. Had offered us a way to cure him. All right, let's How keep poking on Isaac here. Cure Isaac. Some kind of spiritual thing, I guess. Uh-huh. None of us really understood it, but we were desperate. Do you have any idea where the hidden people would have taken Isaac? Space. The hidden people aren't real. Uh, I they very Isaac much away. are. It's the brotherhood. They lied. Eh? Uh? What do you mean when you say the Brotherhood lied? Bjorn talked about finding peace by communing with forest spirits. Okay. I thought it was a... what's the word? A metaphor? No, a crock. <laughs> try anything, and now Isaac's missing. Okay. In the lodge, I saw a photo of you and Isaac with the rest of the Brotherhood. Yeah. They said they could help us, help Isaac, but they've been taking people. Okay. They took Isaac. It's all my fault. All they right. Took Isaac? Have you told the sheriff? Shit. The sheriff. Would knows. you, He's Nelson? Working with them. Would you, knowing what you know about that son of a gun? Um, Glory, I'd like to stay and talk, but. We've got to get the missing person files. Yeah. I, uh, that's actually a good idea. <laughs> I'll make sure Sheriff Bog stays in the diner. Oh, thank you, Glory. Everything you can about Isaac. All right. I finally got some help. More All or less, right. In Isaac Davin. His wife, Glory, believes that the local cult is behind all the missing person cases in Scoggins. Okay. I'm going back to the sheriff's office to find out exactly what he's hiding in his files. Apparently this is a one-horse town to... What? What am I hearing? Oh, okay, it's just the uh, repair oh, guy. Scruffman. you've been there the whole time. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He likes Glory, though, so it, it's cool. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Daryl's disappearance has got to be tied into all of this. Somehow. Yeah. I'm going to talk to... Uh, oh, great. Between the five generators, power all devices using every available power outlet. Generators will evenly split power if used twice. Excuse me. Each device must be powered exactly to their power needs. What the hell? Okay. This is hard. No, it's not. It's okay. Um, all right. So put 25 to each of those. Uh, 15. Let's see. 25 or 15 and 25. That's 40. Okay. So this one's done. Mm -hmm. 
That's 25, so we need to get another five there. Okay. Oh boy. Um, 15 there, that's that. That's 30. All right, we got it. The computer is just going to take like every single This is a fire hazard. I this is this is going to explode. This is this is not safe. I'm plugging this in and then I'm getting back. Yep, got it. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Thank you. All right. So, uh, okay, there we go. Um, that conversation between Glory and me was strictly confidential. <laughs> That's what you do. Draw attention to it. He didn't hear a damn thing. I know you'd like Isaac out of the way, but I'm going. To yeah, play. he's kind of got a little crush you on. Say so. I think Nelson is blowing his little crush on Glory out of proportion here. Um, okay, folks, um, at this point, I'm going to take a break, call it a night, and we will be back next week. We're going to go raid the sheriff's office. See you then. Bye-bye. <laughs>